so take me away across the ocean out in the horizon the night is falling take me away across the ocean hey everyone so we just got off the bus from valencia to lisbenzia lisbenzia something like that we're basically in chicken terra and we couldn't find accommodation in any of the beautiful five towns that most people come here for. So we've had to stay at La and we'll catch the train or a boat to see the other towns. We've just stopped for some lunch after exploring the wharf. And I just want to share with you this new thing I've come across. Here in Italy, they have these, they look like a slushy machine, I guess. And in it is coffee, real coffee. Brian's having some now. Basically, this is how they do their iced coffee. It is the most amazing thing I've ever tasted in regards to coffee. It is like eating a little bit melted coffee ice cream, but it's got real coffee in it, no syrup. What do you think? It's so good. It's amazing. I've been too scared to try it since we've been in Italy, and we finally got one today because it's quite hot. I just said to Brian, thank you. And I just said to Brian, what were we thinking? Why did we not discover this earlier? This is our last stop in Italy and we decided to have some. And we're in the so home good. of the focaccia. Mm -hmm. Apparently Green focaccia. Green light toast toasted. Yeah. I'm having it the Italian one. So focaccia apparently was invented here in Cinque Terre. So was anchovies, or the way that they're served. And pesto came from one of the small towns in Cinque Terre. Welcome to Rio Magori in the Cinque Terre. Isn't it cute? It's amazing. Got some cliff jumpers there. So we've just caught the train from La Spenza and it took about five minutes. Ten. Mm -hmm. Took about ten minutes and uh, we've arrived here. It's about five o'clock, six o'clock. And yeah, we're just going to chill out here, check out the town, maybe Come eat some food out on the rocks and see the sunset. Should be good. What should we do? Get some gelato. So we did it. Gelato. More expensive here. Obviously it's a tourist trap, but... Still tastes good. Definitely cool. You don't look how sweaty I am. It's ridiculous. we would take advantage of being in this beautiful place watching this beautiful sunset and because we are in the region that invented pesto we decided to get some bread sticks and some pesto and we've got plastic cups and we've got open we we'll pretend you can see those we got um, a glass of a bottle of white wine so that we can have some wine and we also got some fresh seafood we got some chips calamari and they even threw a little bit of octopus in there for us from a cafe called Mamma Mia.
So the sun's gone down. It's another sunset for us in Cinque Terre. We're enjoying it so far. Prince still drinking her wine and eating it's pesto. So so we'll end the vlog there and we'll catch you guys tomorrow. Be sure to subscribe and to give the thumbs up. Bye. Bye. <laughs>